from Milwaukee. Lieutenant Krukar is a 2006 graduate of Marquette University. In today's flight, he will maneuver his aircraft under G-forces, ranging from negative one to eight times normal, and fly at airspeeds from 110 miles an hour.
authority and the ability of the F-18 to point at an adversary aircraft. In a very short space, we'll see change direction from a horizontal point down to straight up. It is this ability, combined with an awesome arsenal of air-to-air -air weapons, that make the F-18 a world-class fighter that is feared worldwide. demonstration will highlight the exceptionally slow speed capabilities of the F-A-18. The Hornet is famous for its ability to fly slower than any other comparable fighter. The F-A-18 Hornet remains completely controllable through the use of two flight control computers. GOAT will complete the slow speed pass by selecting maximum afterburner and pitching the aircraft up through the vertical as he finishes with a maneuver known as again the half human ape. But watch now as the airplane is slowed down and the computers keep it in the air.
had its completion. Local set up for one final carrier break to land, but here comes the high speed photo pass. to maintain, fix, and fly these sophisticated machines. Please give a round of applause for the VFA 106 maintainers who made this demonstration possible. <laughs> Lieutenant Krugar and the VFA 106 Hornet demo team would like to thank, first and foremost, the people serving in the nation's armed forces. In addition, they would like to also thank NAS Oceana, the city of Virginia Beach, and the great state of Virginia for the opportunity to perform here today. On behalf of the United States Navy, Command Strike Fighter Wing Atlantic, and the Commanding Officer of Strike Fighter Squadron 106, we thank you for allowing us to demonstrate the FA-18 Hornet. We hope you enjoyed the show. Again, Goat won't be able to hear applause, but he'll see appreciation, so as he taxis in, be sure to give him a huge wave. 